You've noticed it, haven't you? Notice what? I'm referring to Shion. I never thought you of all people would come to me about her. Yes, well, what concerns me has more to do with what machinations may be currently unfolding in secret on Lenigus as we make our way along this tunnel. And you're saying it's related to Shion in some way? Perhaps. She believed there was a good possibility that the Renis Alma may free her from her thorns. One would think after losing the Renis Alma, she would be more dismayed. And yet she isn't. Why? There's also the matter of the power that she inherited from. You heard what she said. She didn't know about the Maiden's power. Mere ignorance does not preclude her deep connection to the events unfolding around us. You recall when her thorns went rampant in Castle Del Faris. I've never seen dark astral energy manifest in such a way. I thought you said all Renans had dark astral energy inside of them. Correct. However, what Xion exhibited was far beyond what any ordinary citizen could ever possibly possess. <laughs> Let me be clear. I do not intend to cast doubt on Xion or her motives. Nevertheless, I cannot shake the feeling that there's more to all of this than what we currently know. Do you disagree? Only every battle went so well. It's obvious that people used to go through here in order to get to the other realms. You think Volron really did seal it off? Go no further! Vacuum Come airborne scoundrels! Sounds like a job for yours truly! Yours are not the skills of just any warrior. Save your compliments! They're all coming after me! Really I'm not scared! I'm totally fine! Back your dreams! Hands in the wind! Now! <sighs> Looks like we won. Hey, look at that enemy. I'll take you all off. Take this. Back to the Try this. Everlasting stop. Explosive ring. We can turn the tables on us. There are still more left. Right. No time to hold the flying spree. What did they do? See ya. Can you take care of them? No sooner said than done. Windwell. Light burst four. Radiant Genesis. You don't mess around. Certainly not. Try this. Begin. Now. Tempest. That's what I like to hear. I 
see supplies and other signs people were living here. Even Zugul cages. It definitely looks like this is where the remnants of Volron's forces hold themselves up. Yeah. They were hiding in a place like this all along. What's this thing? Indeed. Well, sort of. Actually, it's a family staple harkening back eight generations. Um, uh, maybe you can just write all this down? This equipment is really interesting. You must really like it, Alfin. Tip-top As soon as I'm done here, I'm ready! Can't 
Commander of Heaven! Phoenix Blackla! Everyone hanging in there? Tell me, Alfin, wherever did you learn how to wield a sword? I was wondering the same thing too, actually. I'm guessing you knew how to fight before you met the Crimson Crows, right? I used to be a soldier who served a Danon master. I never saw the guy's face, but I still fought for him because he was my employer. Looking back, it wasn't all that different from being a slave. A Danon master? That must have been before the Renans brought you to Lenigus 300 years ago. You must fight using real Danon techniques then. Really? We used to have our own sword arts? There's a lot of our own history we've lost since the Renans first invaded. It's not all magic and art. I'm sure it includes things like sword styles too. It's incredible and also a little surreal to see those arts still survive after all this time. Not only that, but I first learned these moves while serving one ruler. Only to end up turning my sword on the ruling class altogether. Pretty ironic when you think about it. I apologize if I dredged up unfortunate memories for you. Nah, we're good. It's in the past now. All we ever did in those days was stir up trouble. You're using those skills for a good cause now. It's not all bad. I suppose this is what people mean when they say that every cloud has its silver lining. Exactly. He's using those sword skills to make the world better. Could be a lot worse. True enough. I will stop worrying about mentioning it then. Mm. How much do they have to steal from us to be satisfied? What's that thing's purpose, anyway? Some kind of siphon that sends the astral energy the Lord's harvested to Lenigus? Not as far as I'm aware. That said, it has become evident since the forming of the Renis Alma, as well as other recent events, that my insight may be... thin. I would, as I believe the saying goes, take what I say with a grain of salt. No, Halim. At the very least, I believe we can assume that whoever is pulling the strings behind the scenes has had this in the works for quite some time. Why is that? The people on Lenigus may have plenty of resources at their disposal, but not even they could prepare something like that in a mere month. Something of that magnitude takes considerable time, as well as a predetermined goal in mind. Then what was the crown contest for? At this stage, I think it was but one step in the greater scheme we see unfolding before us. What that scheme is exactly, I haven't a clue. For now, I believe we should keep moving. The path continues. It's quite possible it will take us all the way to Cislodia. Agreed. Let's keep moving. So Xion's thorns are dark astral energy. Rinwell. Are you worried about Xion? Of course I am. But I don't know how to talk to her about it. You and me both. it out there. Dragon Force! 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 D
after we passed the peak. Looks like it could be worth something. Thing. We made it to Cislodia. We need to get that bridge down somehow. It looks like we can control it from our side. Let's take a closer look. <sighs> Are you okay, Law? Hmm? Oh, fine. Just thinking. The past is a real downer. And that's why I'm focused on what's ahead of me. You? Yeah. I'm going to stay the path. As long as we're all together, I know we'll be all right. Same here. Now let's get moving. <laughs> Do you sense one of your friends, Hoodle? Cross through here. Stop. 
stop. Who goes there? My name is Alfin. We're not your enemies. Did you say Alfin? Slap me silly. It really is you. Forgetting someone? Renwell. Oh, glad to see you're doing okay. What are you guys doing out here? We're patrolling the realm. Never thought I'd bump into you all on my rounds, though. Heck, enough of me, though. What's going on up in the sky? Feels like the world's gonna end. Get this That's what we're trying to figure out ourselves. And as it happens, I've got a big favor to ask. I had an inkling that's why you'd come back, as soon as I saw you in the distance. So you beat all the lords, huh? Damn, you really must be a hero. I just did what I had to. So can you send anybody to help Ganeth Haros? I think we can help out. I'll hit up the other resistance groups and rustle up some support. I doubt they'll have a problem sending people once I mention it's you who's asking. Thanks. If you guys can help out, that'll give us a chance to do something about that wedge out in the ocean. Yeah, I think that's something only you guys can handle. Speaking of which, that thing's out in the middle of the ocean. How do you even plan on reaching it? By boat. We're about to go look for one. No rest for the weary, I see. Hey, what happened to that mask you used to wear? It's a long story. Let's just say I lost it. I sure never expected to run into Bregan. Cislodia's probably in good hands with him. Yeah. Now we can focus on finding a ship. It's... Freezing. It's always like... I won't forgive you! Take it! Great. Next! As impressive as always. Ah, here I hoped I was improving. We won that by a mile. Get lost! Dragon form! As impressive as always. Ah, and here I hoped I was improving. Together, that wasn't even a problem. What do you say we check back in on the ranch? Something feels odd here. Be on your guard. Let's see what you've got. We did it! As impressive as always. Ah, no, I think I mean you're even better than I've never seen Xion actually look. Clustered. Our superiority was undeniable. It feels invigorating to dominate a battle. I was certain I saw you yawn. Come now.
now. I'm certainly not that relaxed. There. Blazing sword, okay? A little water's not going to hurt it. Hi, Oodle! Vacuum blade! Take it! Blade! <laughs> <laughs> you you have to be incredible! Brute force is nothing without elegance of form. Even break a sweat. Discourteous, aren't you? We've turned the tables on him. There are still Take more it. left. Right. No time to hold back. Water. Together, that wasn't even a problem. Valuable as I think it is? Right, here it goes! Dragon Swarm! You're finished! There. Together, that wasn't even a problem. There are still more Take left. Let right. that shell hide you something case. Bloody hell. Only the best materials in your garments. You really do have quite the discerning eye, Dohali. Discourteous, aren't you? You're mine! Crush me! Great! My turn! Here! That 
was almost too easy. No enemy can stand against us. Retreat if you know what's good for you. Come and face me. Your blade moves like shit. I just let my instincts take over. How fast? Nice. No scratches on my shield or my armor. Thing. We should be able to cook here. Woo! Oh, y you know, don't you think we're running a little low on food? Uh oh, ho, ho. you're still not done fishing yet? Boring. You need patience to fish. I hope we catch something decent. Indeed. Hungry bellies are counting on this. <laughs> yeah! something. You've got to know when to quit. When to quit. Reel it in. That wasn't much of a challenge. You sure know what you're doing. I don't even know. something. I'll let you go this time.
time to try a different spot. Next time. Reel it in. You've got to know when to quit. We should be able to cook here. I 
I've got to keep my equipment. <laughs> that was nothing. Shion, could we talk a moment? Hey, do you have time to talk? There's something I need to ask you. Um, of course. What's up? It's about the doll I used to have as a little girl. I gave it some more thought, and I still don't remember actually receiving it from anyone. You were so little. I don't think it's that surprising you've forgotten, is it? Yeah, but here's the thing. That doll was so old, I'm starting to think I just always had it with me from the start. I know that it's extremely unlikely, but after last time we talked, it got me thinking. Maybe... Maybe you brought the doll that child made with you to Lenegas. I couldn't be. Are you saying you didn't? Uh... Look, logically speaking, I know it's a lot more likely that you didn't bring it with you than you did. But you can't say for sure you didn't, right? Crazier things have happened. I always thought I'd be alone, only to end up meeting you and Law and Rinwell and Kisara and Dohalim. Sometimes things happen in life that we never thought possible. You make a good point. I left everyone and everything I knew behind 300 years ago. But now, I'm not so alone anymore. Exactly. You crossed all those centuries to find all of us, so... Why can't a little doll have made the same jump too? Right? Look, it's up to you to decide if there's any meaning behind all of this. But I choose to think there is. Yeah, I think so too. There's something beautiful about the whole thing that simply can't be denied. Sorry if I'm a bit restless during the night. Oh. Did you get enough sleep? No. Aw, are you tired, Hoodle? You sure. He's not just trying to hide from us? soul who is in dire need. Sounds like our cue to step in and help. Well, if it ain't the blazing sword and his merry crew. Mahavar? I can't believe you're still alive. Of course I am. If you landlubbers can make it out of that sinking ship alive, ain't no reason an old sea dog like me wouldn't too. Yeah, but that wave hit hard. I'm glad to see you're okay. Sorry we put you in so much danger back there. I'll water under the bridge at this point. You helped make one of my life's dreams come true. The ship, on the other hand, she took a bit of a beating, though, I'll admit. Really? What happened to it? It looks fine to me on the outside. She's fine now, but she was in rough shape when I made it back here. Engine chamber gave up the ghost. Without a lot of options, I decided to talk to the head honcho of the Dark Wings and see if he could help at all. And wouldn't you know it, crazy fool sent over Renan engineers to help. Can you believe it? Renan? Yep. Said they came from Menencia. They were real professionals. Did what they needed to and didn't give me guff or anything. I was damn near floored. So they did the work themselves. Good on them. Well, they did a bang-up job, because she's better than ever now. Speaking of which, I take it she's why you're here? Yes. We need to get out on the ocean, and fast. When can we set sail? Give the man a minute to think it over, Alfin. He hasn't even said yes yet. <laughs> it's all right, little lady. I'm a man of the sea. I'll gladly help. Hop aboard, folks.
Oh. Oh. This thing already looked plenty huge from afar. Seeing it up close makes it really hit home. I didn't expect the journey to go so smoothly. I figured the Renans would send something to sink us. Maybe they didn't think we had the nerve to come. Somehow I kind of doubt that. It's entirely possible they don't see us as a threat. What do you mean? That they think they're beyond our reach. Still, this structure is quite the unusual sight. Truth be told, I've never seen anything like it. You're right. It doesn't look like the buildings on Lenegas at all. Or like any Renan structure, for that matter. It's weird. It doesn't feel like the kind of thing that has people inside, either. Yeah, it's definitely something creepy. What the hell is it even made of? I don't know. It's not mechanical or biological, but it's definitely... alive in some way. I'm okay. It's nothing. Well, what do we do now? We have to stop this thing from siphoning off all of Dana's astral energy. That means finding the core and smashing it to bits. Okay, but look at the size of it. I don't know if we'll find the core just wandering around. Good point. Can anyone get a read on the astral energy around us? Any kind of a sign? There's a rather enormous flow of energy moving directly upwards. If we wish to follow it, we'll have to do some climbing. <sighs> Rinwell? Over there? Hey, what's up with you? Huh? I... You okay? What happened? I'm not sure. When I was reaching out to the astral energy, I thought I heard... a voice. A voice? Yeah. Mm. I couldn't make out any words, but it sounded like it wanted me to come to it. This seems like a trap, right? It's not a trap! How can you tell? Listen, I don't know why, but when it spoke to me, I knew it wasn't hostile. What do you think? It could well be a trap. However, it's also our only real option, short of wandering aimlessly about. Let's trust Rinwell on this. You sure? Yeah. Eh. It beats the alternative, I guess. <laughs> what did I say? Sheesh, it's like walking on eggshells around here. Sometimes you have to choose your words more carefully, Law. Huh? Oh, uh, right. Stay sharp. We're going in. Okay, I'll do it. See you guys on the next episode.